and strike. All right, YouTube's been fighting us, chat. Can you hear me? I've been trapped in YouTube's asshole for 25 <laughs> years. It appears. There we go. Guys, let's all leave YouTube. Not now, because we're streaming, we're gonna have fun, but... Suddenly there are no more people watching. <laughs> Don't even joke. Don't even joke about that. Well, what are we doing here, then? I don't know. But hi, chat. Hi, everyone. Fun story. So we spent like a minute trying to figure out why we weren't streaming, even though I was getting the stream through the preview on YouTube. So for, for a second, I thought, oh, is there an actual button that I need to press to go live? That sounds like something stupid YouTube would do. I don't see it. That's because it's above the chat. It's nowhere near the options. Or the settings for the stream. It's above the chat where you're not looking. God damn to, it. To start your fucking stream. And the thing is, the button says go live, which is the button you pressed to start a stream and set up all the settings. That does... So you're like, you're conditioned to think, <laughs> oh, you don't press it to go live, literally. It's just to set up a stream. Oh. This is why I used the old streaming layout or whatever for everything else up until now didn't they like stop supporting that or something probably also you're gonna want to make sure to not speak into the ground and speak like towards the mic oh sorry yeah you've been like <laughs> hey guys <coughs> my screen is down here well well, I would say maneuver, but you currently have a wiener dog on your back. Hi, chat. Uh, this is uh, Stacy. This is CJ. This is my fiance. They're very sweet. Hi. Thorn is much louder much than ever. I do. Yeah. I'm getting. I'm still getting the volume figured out. Like what is what a good volume is supposed to look like. That in is my new mixer. Don't worry. I go ahead and get back to the setting you were at before because you sound perfect to me. I think that I just need to lower the desktop volume. Okay. How uh, how's it sounding now, folks? Hello. I am talking in relation to Thorn. <coughs> I'm coughing. <coughs> in relation to yourself. <coughs> Got a bit of the acid reflux in here. Thorn is now quiet. Let me just turn up. A, turn I don't up hear a him at all. <laughs> we'll figure it out eventually. All right. There we go. All right. So hi guys. Uh, today we're gonna. This is. So here's the thing. Thorn has been going through like weeks of technical problems, and Yoshi's been busy. So we don't got nothing to upload. So. I just got back home from work. I wanted to make sure there was something on the channel uh, for y'all to watch. So we're going to stream some Jackbox Party Packs today. Um, just have some fun. Give you guys something to fucking enjoy while we get everything reset up. Thorn's problems are over, it seems. Uh, technical Finally. problems. Yeah. And uh, I'm kind of tired, but I I want to have some fun. Yes, you will be able to join Stacy. Um Let's go and get started. First thing we're going to play is Quiplash 2. Um, for the uninitiated, for those unaware of what Jackbox is, there's probably a few of you, um, this is a multiplayer party trivia type game that you all can join and play. Uh, all you need to do is go to jackbox.tv. We're going to give you a room code that you can use to join. Um, there's three people on stream, so one, two, three, four, five. Five of you will be able to play and participate, and the rest of you guys can join the audience and kind of collaborate and uh, participate as yourselves. So we're going to get this set up. We're going to have it so that we three join, join first. first. Oh, God, oh, God, what? I think you want to get yourself, CJ. Uh-oh. Wait, what the fuck? Oh, wait, oh, wait. Yeah, you unmute yeah. yourself. Okay, there we go. There we go. <laughs> yep. They've got a weird setup because I can't find their headphone splitter. Yeah. Well, it's not that I it's not that I can't find it. It's that I just got home and I can't be fucked he to find it. Want to find it is the thing. <laughs> Technically you can't find it. 
Technically, yes. Oh, Blue, please get off my back. Though I can't guarantee if I tried that I would be able to find it. Alright, so. I will DM the room code. It's very funny. And also, folks, uh, this is going to have to be, like, first come, first serve for uh, whoever gets in from the audience, just because uh, we had no time to prep for this. Yeah. Though I will ask that if uh, if you do participate, um, please, if for the next game, allow others to join before you do. If we're at a point where, like, no one else is joining, like, everybody's, like, being cool and, like, not joining, but they're pretty much everybody's had their turn, then go ahead and join. But, uh, you know what I mean. All right, so Thorn, here is the code. <laughs> Sorry, I'm emptying my pockets. I haven't even done that yet. Keys, headphones, wallet, a fish for some reason. I, I don't I know why, but I looked up when you said that, like, what, really? <laughs> <laughs> or you saying, I accidentally put the room code into my name. Ah, oh, yes, our best friend, Hog. Hog. Your friend, Hog. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. All right. Uh, and now we switch to the Jame. We've dropped no frames. That's good. Uh, what? That's There's rare. I know. I don't have a good streaming computer. Uh, I don't know why the screen capture is not showing up. Hold up. Life sucks. Hold on. Enter a specific window. Jackbox. There we go. There you go. Jo uh, enter that room code. Join in. First five people in get to officially like be their be their own ass selves. Everybody else joins the audience. Your friend Holt. <laughs> we need one more people. <laughs> we need one more people. All right, I'll give it a second for audience members to join. Audience members will be kind of collaborating. So here's the rules of Quiplash. They're gonna explain it, but I'm cooler. So, uh, you're everyone's gonna be presented with two prompts on their device. Uh, answer them however you want. Uh, typically answer it answering it funny will get you votes and then you your answer is going to go up against somebody else's answer uh, and then everybody gets to vote what their favorite is and uh, whoever gets the most votes gets the most points and whoever has the most points wins so let's be funny don't be assholes but you guys are good you're a super chill bunch so I don't see that being a problem all right everybody's in let's do it Let's jack a box. Ew. <laughs> I'm sorry. Quiplash. Don't worry, you did. You don't have to play Quiplash one to know the story. Oh, thank Everybody's God. Strapped in. Good deal. Let's do it. Remember, extra players can join the audience and pick their favorite quips. Audience and if anybody's just joining us, you can join the audience at any time. The code's in the corner there. This is round one. You are about to see two prompts on your device. Type something hilarious or not for each one. Then everyone gets to decide if your answer is better than someone else's. Democracy at work. The more people who vote for your answer, the better That would be a oh, whoa. Let's go. Talking to the mic. Ooh. Quit talking into the floor. All right. No, they can hear me. No, honey. No, they can't. No, they can't. <laughs> and you want to it again. again. Oh, fuck. <laughs> My keyboard's not working. 
Why aren't you just using your phone for the game? Because I don't know. There we go. Alright, we're good. These aren't my... Oh yeah, the audience has their own question they could answer as well. Great thing to yell before jumping out of an airplane. Okay, no, it's not. Why is it? Ooh, whoa. <laughs> I guess I guess that's accurate. Whoa! My computer's freaking out. Whoa, dudes! <laughs> How fast do you think I'm gonna hit the ground? It won't let me type or do anything. Let's see what we got. First up. Jackbox is kind of shit sometimes. The apocalypse or okay. CJ fucking unmuting. God damn it. The way to get votes is to reference the stream. That's that's how I that's how I've noticed this like this game works when you stream it. If you join Try like that, less. you're just gonna be in the audience. Fuck me. My, sh it's not. You gotta make sure your name is exactly the same. Mm. Ah, damn it! The audience. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with my computer. And next is what '80s teenage alien Alf is probably up to right now. Jacob and I are ideal for going head to head in Quiplash because we're both strange. We're both strange indeed. Selling guild for space air or dead. Like her, no joke, just dead. Oh fuck, I have to vote. Democracy, um. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know what Elf did when he was alive. What was Elf about? Just like an alien who did shit in a house? And I think he ate cats. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's very 2020. Up next, a weird I think Alf is the only person where you could say, I think he ate cats and it's okay. I don't know, I'm just thinking of a joke from an episode of MST3K that I think was referencing Alf, but I don't actually know. <laughs> Kaboom. <laughs> Did you get back in properly? I don't think so. It says audience member. Well, you can join. You can play next time. Sorry. Oh, the audience comes in clutch. It's like the audience has so much sway in this game. The players don't do shit. Coming up next, how does Adele come up with those great songs? watching people to write about her hobbies. Oh, and the other one is CJ. So, CJ was having technical problems. <laughs> she come with her great songs, you CJ. <laughs> CJ, what did you do to Adele? Um... Spitfire, hashtag dope rhymes, hashtag eat. Or roll, bitch, you're on fire, break it down. Break it down like DX? I went for the one I hate less. <laughs> <laughs> That's gotta be the way it is sometimes. Sure hope it was mine. You were hashtag ye. Well, shit. I feel like I could have gone without the hashtag ye, but I must. You doomed yourself. Chuck the <laughs> Chuck the boat muncher. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Freddy Bear from Five Nights at Freddy's. I could just throw him in the ocean. He'll just fucking, like, short circuit. Ah, uh, that one guy liked Freddy Bear. 
Was it you? No. Oh, you can't even vote, can you? Quiplash! That means you got the... Super Quiplash! The overwhelming majority. Ruining Thorne's equipment. <laughs> I like Disco Diva. Me too. <laughs> That's so abstract. No, I, <laughs> I do believe he does both. If you try to join again on your laptop, it might... Or is your keyboard just absolutely not working? My keyboard's just not working. Damn it. I was thinking if you rejoin on the same device, it might let you. It's making, like, ticking noises every time I try to type. It's like... Free passage to Narnia. I wouldn't go through that. Mm, no. Well, Brittany, it wasn't LP curse, it was SFA curse. Because my first audio interface died two days before the SFA movie was set to be released. And I hadn't finished it yet. So I narrowly avoided disaster. Yeah. Frankly, at, at the point where it was at, like, there may have been, like, a one or two minor goofs, but you probably could have been updated, uploaded in the state it was in. Attention audience, while you wait for these annoyingly slow players, why not try the audience play along? If you hear me giggling, you understand I've come up with something stupid. <laughs> is that blue? Yeah, he just is upset because I moved him. Oh. Dang it. Come on. Uh, thank you, Tonshad, how, uh, however that's pronounced. Um, we we don't generally go back and do second playthroughs of games we, we've done before. Twilight Princess excluded, because I'm doing the HD version. But also, that was Travis, and he's no longer on the channel. I couldn't. I spent too long typing out the exact perfect answer for the first one that I couldn't think of anything for the second one. Right, let's get to it. The first prompt is a good sign. Everyone in your dance class hates you. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. I mean, why would I assume they like me? Taekwon flamenco. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. That second's that's too relatable. Too relatable. Has this happened? It's like, all Travis right. got way too busy with work in order to uh, do anything with us, so eventually he decided he just has to officially make it so he's leaving the channel. And this was a few years back. Yes. You always gotta. You always gotta like put on a poker face when you're uh, confronted with your own answer. Be like, yeah, that's pretty good. And then at the end, you just look conceited. Vote on your devices. If my if CJ if you left me for adventure, I feel like I'd understand. A piece of shit goose would be very upsetting. <laughs> I'm leaving you for the goose of goose game. Oh no. That is a piece of shit, Goose. You are a horrible goose. I love that. That's such a succinct description for a game. It's a beautiful day and you are a horrible goose. <laughs> yeah. I don't regret spending $15 on that game that I spent two hours playing. It's on Game Pass now, so I can play it again. I should play it and do like an LP of it. I That'd be fun. It. 
It'd be a real short one. Bubba, I think this is the second time you went up against CJ and got three points. You got lucky this time. You left the chat. I know, my computer shut off. Oh. Nobody likes the dumple or underpaid librarians. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's more giving adults nightmares right now. On the bright side, I can type now. Ah, oh, the safety question. Sniper Bear didn't even come up with that, so they get they get half the points. Next in line, the best way to get out of a corn maze. It's voting time. <laughs> Fly, I don't know. <laughs> I, what if I hadn't forgotten, goddammit? Yeah, that's... G <laughs> Sorry, I had to completely stop talking. I nearly outed myself as the writer of that answer. <laughs> well, I didn't win anyway. But thanks for voting for me, Thorne. I liked it. I, it. That's the one I came up with in like ten, in like five seconds because I spent too much time writing the fucking other one, which I can't even remember now. <laughs> I octane shit. <laughs> oh, I thought that uh, said monthly red is. Ugh. It hurts. I, I thought it said motherly red, which is probably worse. <laughs> it's. Same place. <laughs> Ugh. Both are gross. One one is natural, the other there were some drugs involved. High octane horseshit takes home the quiplash. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, never mind. Oh no, yeah. Mind. After all. Next in the hopper. Sorry, I just clocked my pop filter. Well, That's why welcome, to the, <laughs> welcome to the same answer. Uh, eeny, meeny, miny, you. I like the one that has like a full stop period. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but no I comma. I remember that one because it feels like saying it deadpan makes it worse. But there's no comma, so it's just, it's a noun. It's the harder daddy. Harder daddy. <laughs> Bubba. I this was all on Bubba's side. Bubba, I think you're kicking like a few asses right now. Is that liquid blue? I can't see the color. Bad parkour. That was a safety cue. That's all for round two. Let's see where the points went. That just feels nonsensical. Your friend's little. I feel like Bubba should be higher. All right, round three. This is round three. The last. Just we're getting all the points for the one CJ missed. <laughs> it's okay. You'll be able to play. We'll play one more uh, quip lash, uh, so CJ can join in. Okay. Oh, I love that. I love this one. Come up with a full name for this acronym. Um. Went for the first thing that came to my head, it's probably gonna be bad. <laughs> I'm so mad. Alright, good enough. Alright, but, alright, CJ, since you can't participate, what would your answer be? Tell everybody. See, here's the 
here's the thing. <laughs> what? Mm -hmm. What? <laughs> it's not so much a name, more like an organization. That's fine. That's a name. Uh, Gaze on Ritalin. <laughs> Grand Ruler Robogore. Is that an Undertale thing? No, that's Asgore. I don't think so. <laughs> if Asgore was a robot, I guess he'd be. Oh Robogore. man, that's my favorite Undertale ship. Um, <laughs> Gordon <laughs> Obtain Ramsey. All right, you guys pick a few uh, a few different. Um, uh, answers for this one, by the way. Sure. Yeah, you get to pick three answers. Oh, sorry for crinkling the plastic right in my microphone. I forgive you. Has Thorne ever played Rune Factory? You mean the guy who uh, let's played Rune Factory? I haven't played the first one or the second one. I played a little bit of the third one. But I haven't played the console ones. That reminds me of the of the one Q and A video I did on my channel where somebody asked me if I played Five Nights at Freddy's. I'm like, yeah, yeah, I did. <laughs> It was after I'd done, like, a full Let's Play of FNAF 2 and a half a one of FNAF 3, because FNAF 3 is shit. Yeah, I said it. That may have been a controversial opinion five years ago. Oh, Bubba comes away with it. Bubba pulled ahead. Yup. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chuck the boat. Wait, that was you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was really proud of that one. Top, surprise. Top answer of the game. Deserved. Alright. Uh, we're going to play with new players. Um, change to the no. Alright. This time use your phone, damn it. Or your computer if it's my working now. My computer's working now. Okay, we're cool. Good. Plus, my computer's not going to die soon. Alright, so... There's the code, CJ. Oh my god, I'm hideous. I'm hideous. Hideous. And there it is for you, Thorn. I feel like I've seen that code before. And remember, if you've already played, please allow other people the chance to play. Unless, uh, unless nobody else joins, then feel free to come on in. Alright, y'all. Get in. It's it, first come, first serve, since we have no real time to prep for this. Yeah, it's not Patreon only. Everybody can join. Not not CJ. I think I remember you. Is that Galaxy Force? Huh? What? Somebody's named not CJ. Hmm. Yeah, I thought so. <laughs> Snowblind, is that a Black Sabbath reference? Alright, let's go. When you think about it, everybody but me is not CJ. Shit. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> I'm glad I've been scratching your Stardew Witch. BJG. Oh, that song never gets old. Ready for some quiplash? Me too. Oh, this is gonna All be right, quiplash to you. This will be our last quiplash, then we're going to move on to another game. Probably TKO. That game is so much fucking fun. Ooh, I love you, but you give me no feet room. Alright, here we go. Folks in the audience can try the audience play along while we wait for our players to finish. <laughs> I kind of got the same question twice. Really now. Oh god, I have to look up how to spell this. That might give it away. <laughs> if you really love something, let it fart. <laughs> let us join TSN. This one's stupid. I don't even know if it's funny. I laughed at it, so. 
<laughs> if you really love something, let it let it slap it. <laughs> let it slap it. Let it slap what? Itself? Let it have power of attorney. Just make sure Gem you send the fucking forms in. Gemstone, search it up on YouTube. I did a full LP of Story of Seasons and Rune Factory 4. And just in case you also suggested Animal Parade. Did those years ago. Isn't an Animal, uh, animal Crossing, isn't a... Um... Harvest Moon LP, like your most viewed LP for some reason. Yeah, the first part of uh, Year of Leaf Valley. No, I w you asshole piece of shit! I was about to click send. You, God damn it! Did you at least get one in? Yes, I okay. did. I ran out of time on my last one too. Damn it! Uh, well. Just as well because it it involved CJ somehow. <laughs> body. Iguano, why did I leave my body this time? Or where did I leave my body? This? God damn it. Okay, blue. That's enough. Maybe um, I that one. <laughs> I, thought, I thought the where said why, so it was like, why <laughs> did I leave my body this time? Aw, oh, man. I was ready for a date. Aw, oh, beans, where'd my body go? Oh my god. Everyone liked that answer. Nobody liked mine. <laughs> the carrot wings. Next, what word should never be followed by an exclamation mark? Vote on your devices. <laughs> Neither of these are a single word. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Bubba. Oh, Blue's drinking. I was wondering what that noise was. Sorry, we have babies. Hairy baby. Smelly lady. Ooh. Ah. Uh. <sighs> CJ versus not CJ. All right, R slash atheists. <laughs> <laughs> no one be excited about church. <laughs> Well, CJ, um, you you are a raccoon, so you should know this. Okay. Eh? People have suggested Fantasy Life for years now, and I've always been sort of considering it, but I need to actually play it first. Blue, what are you doing to me? Always loved you in the WarioWare LPs. Thank you. I'd like to perhaps do another one day, but I'm not sure because Smooth Moves and Gold are probably the two most interesting WarioWare games. I have touched on Wii U, but I don't I don't like that one so much. The cutscenes are weirdly bad. Can you put a P under it? <laughs> I mean <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> you can. Somebody read in school. Well, but they... only in first grade. Well, I mean, can you put a... No, here's the question. Can you, pee... can you put a P under 12 of them? Do you remember the Princess and the P episode of the Rugrats? Yeah, I think so. Come on. Oh, an exact tie? Are you shitting me? Damn. Oh, fair enough. I like can you put a P under it. Next on the list, the worst part about sharing a sleeping bag with this Uh hmm. Y'all choose your words wisely. Put in your votes. The worst part about <laughs> <laughs> I don't even get the Jacob Stan part. I'm laughing at the smell. <laughs> It was supposed to be Jacob Stank, but it ran out of time. Oh. <laughs> well, oh, so it both relates to how I well, see, smell bad. See, <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, CJ is my stan, but... that. So I guess I would be the worst part of that sharing. <laughs> <laughs> they just won't shut up about Jacob. Wait, did I just call myself my own stan? <laughs> I'm your stanny. CJ is my... Okay, I just want to make sure. I'm glad I still won that. 
You were like fucked up. <laughs> Dang we. Dang we. <coughs> Is that a can Canadian <laughs> thing? I don't know what either of these mean. <laughs> like not, not beavers, bevers. <laughs> <laughs> bevers. Bevers, alright. Bevers, eh. How long? A drunk Canadian. I'm from Canada. This hard talk. Hey, guys. I risked you very much. <laughs> I also fly it. Did you die? <laughs> Still one of my favorite things you ever said. <laughs> Hopefully, we can create another episode of the Jacob Show uh, this year. Maybe. You need to be extremely jet lagged up. <laughs> yes, I probably will be. Man, <laughs> Man fuck bonanzas. <laughs> I don't have a new name for bananas. Knees. <laughs> oh. oh my god, it's already 11.30. I'm going to bed late tonight, aren't I? Ah, uh, Jacob. Ah, oh, yeah, fuck bonanzas. <laughs> God damn it. I like knees. Because it was mine, but. Oh God. I have a man fuck bonanzas pretty much every day. <laughs> Spooge. Damn it, I hate it. <laughs> Not splooge. Spooge. God damn it. That's a name of a character in Invader Zim. Oh yeah. Commander Spooge. No. Or whatever. <laughs> Not literally. No, it's it's like Commander Zim. No. No, the name is Scooge, not Spooge. Yeah, I know. Okay. I, I got I actually thought it was Spooge for a second. No. I guess you couldn't get away with calling a children's show character Spooge. Stop it. Stop. Round one is behind us. Let's see how you score. Well, I have no. to let go of it. Well, let go of it. <laughs> Sorry, CJ was playing with the uh, with the handles of the cooler, and I told him to stop in a weirdly intimidating way. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next up. While the players enter their clips, audience members can try the audience play along on their devices. <sighs> Shit, no, that's a cop out. Oh fuck, I don't know how to spell simple words. <laughs> <laughs> you know this <laughs> this one works because of the particular synonym I use for it. The best way to tell if someone is dead. One of them said rob them. <laughs> <laughs> when you see a dead body in the street, you gotta see what drops they have. Challenge them to Mortal Kombat with a C. That's less threatening than Mortal Kombat with a K. Starting us off. Oh, sweet Jesus. I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hate that it's going to make me vote against Scrungamo. <laughs> I want to vote for Scrungamo so much, but I can't. When you put get tetanus sluts in my face, I can't. <laughs> Something tells me that was yours, Thor. I'm dying. Oh, look. <laughs> I just noticed your name is Thrinkbrink. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> I'm coming from behind. That's how you get tetanus. What? <laughs> Ready, set, vote. <laughs> 
posted the local 7-Eleven or Canada? What if it's a local 7-Eleven in Canada? Does Canada have 7-Elevens? I'm sure they do. They only have Tim Hortons. They only have 7-Elevens. <laughs> Nothing else. Uh, I like that one. Oh, the tie! Ah. Yeah! The actual players are very split. The audience is wherever the fuck they want to be. Oh, oh, that's a great question, Quiplash. Oh, Lincoln Log. I love both of these shit. Fuck. I love them both. I went with the Lincoln log. <laughs> that's so creative. I'm the only one. No, no, three members of the audience did. You're good. We're the ones with the big IQ. And next, what unicorn flatulence smells like. Put in your votes. Rainbow's Why butt on fire. Why Peach? <laughs> <laughs> well, rainbows are light. Light comes from the sun. The sun is on fire. Therefore, it's just a regular rainbow and this answer is disqualified. Well, rainbows are light reflecting off of moisture. Ew. Right, but if you take the ocean to the sun, what happens? Yeah, it evaporates, much like Sheikun's chance of winning. Never mind. So it doesn't smell like anything. <laughs> so, in comparison, it's pleasant. <laughs> I don't know why I chose Princess Peach. It was the first thing that came to mind. Well, she's the only Nintendo character I can think of that, like, off the top of my head, that has conclusively taken a shower. Did you get? All right. I'm voting for... I'm not even going to read the other one. I just... You, no repeating answers here. The only Nintendo character who's conclusively taken a shower. <laughs> that should be an answer. No, never mind. Don't actually do that, because then I won't vote for it. Spooch 2! Sorry, Thorn. <laughs> oh, well, the audience liked it. I didn't They were Civil War soldiers. <laughs> <laughs> they were Civil War soldiers. <laughs> okay, I'm not coming from behind. It's voting time. I hope they are deathly allergic to me. What smells so good? <laughs> Thumpster Dracula donated two dollars and says Mario bathed in Superstar Saga. Where's that? Hold on. What? Mario, don't forget to wash your foreskin. He wasn't showering in that. He was outside of the bathtub. <laughs> doesn't count. Just being in the general vicinity of a shower doesn't make you clean. I just needed to see this again because, like, oh, I forget always whether or not it's an actual image or if it was just... If it's just a meme. <laughs> Employees at Ikea hate it when you arrive. That's me. <laughs> at yeah. any situation yeah. at work. That's, that was me at when I worked at Bell's, when I worked in retail. I was like, oh great, you're here. It could have been my fucking like, grandparents. I was like, great. And I liked my step-grandparents. They were like the only part of my step-family I liked. Aha! You see, if I... Arrive was like the perfect word, or the perfect synonym for this situation. If I would have said shown up, I don't think it would have been funny. Oh god. Ugh. Lady Elaine stealing things. I never actually watched Mr. Rogers, so I don't know who that is. 
But the other one is just... I don't like it. He's the dude that um, Tom Hanks is playing in that movie. Lady Elaine? No. <laughs> well, that's... Fucking Mr. Rogers. I know who Mr. Rogers is. I don't know who Lady Elaine is because I never watched Mr. Rogers. Oh, I thought you said you didn't know who Mr. Rogers was. Of course I know who Mr. Rogers is. Ah. How do you drive by a snuggle? I think that's, that's just slapping out. somebody with your body. <laughs> yeah. That's like a, a lariat from, out, from like, with your body waving outside the vehicle. You're, you're in the top four. Three. Wheel. This is round three, the last flash. One final chance to catch I'm up. I'm at four. Everyone gets the same prompt this time. Word lash. These word lash instructions. Come up with a hit new video game with this word in the title, beard. But imagine there already is one. There's weird beard, which makes I forget which game, but they made a game. Oh, they made a tilted tower. No, not tilted towers is from Fortnite. Uh, I forget the name of the game. I have it on Switch, but it's like a Tetris game where you gotta balance the pieces. Super Beard Bros. Three. I like Super Beard Bros. Um, I don't like this word. I'm not. I'm, I'm getting nothing from this. I don't like having this word. Can my face stop producing hair? I very much have this word. <laughs> you have a lot of this word. Yeah, I don't know how it happened. Let's see the I just realized I hate shaving, and then I, I was like, oh now. shit, this is working out. Beard Buster's the closest shave. <laughs> what the fuck? What hole does this beard go in? Fear the beard. Bowser Beard and the Two Sons. God of Beard, Beard's Revenge. Dick! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't I don't want to vote for it, but my finger's coming. Here it comes. God damn it, I'm giving it a go. God damn it. <laughs> it could go in front or behind. Beard dick or dick beard. <laughs> And either one is unpleasant. A dick beard is just a hairy scrotum. Yes, it is, Thor. Yes, it is. First, the bronze. Bring out the silver and the gold. Let's melt those metals. Oh, Dick didn't win. That makes me feel better. I think Beard Bust. I think you won that, CJ. Go. Oh, you did. Woo! Excuse me. Hey. We're done. Hey. Let's see the final scores. Who won? Oh shit! Me, By forty points. By forty points. I'm the funniest person I ever lived. Get to, again. You were the top <laughs> answer. <laughs> As long as I get top answer, I'm fine. Cool. All right, guys, we're gonna move on to another game. Uh, let's play some TKO. That yes. game is awesome. That game's a little bit more complicated. Um, it's got a lot of steps to it, and it takes a while, but it's fun. Essentially, this one's got drawing involved. Um, normally, I like I. Normally I have the rule, it's not like I can enforce it, but normally I have the rule is if like, if you're actually a good artist, you gotta use either your mouse or your finger, whatever you're using for this. But if you have a, if you have your tablet plugged in, I guess you could use it. Again, I can't enforce that anyway, but. Alright. TKO. Let me join. This game lets you pick your avatar, which is nice. Uh, I 
I like the catfish. Oh, you're in a weird position, and you're gonna choke yourself. I'm snoring. There we go. And the code for Thorn. Sorry, I had to do something. Oh, you, you little snake. I'm the snake. Brant Finn. Alright, guys. Uh, here is your code. Come on in. I feel like since this is a new game, it's a free-for-all, so. McChicken. This game has really good art. I love, this game is so stylish. Seems to work better on mobile than PC for some reason. I think that's what it's made for, so that's probably understandable. Alright, I'll give y'all a second to uh, pick your avatars and stuff. Oh, it's an elephant. I thought that was like a weird jellyfish. I see it. I see it's like nose and it's other eye. And it's like tail, I guess. It's got like a squidward nose, if you look at it that way. SpongeBob, don't call me Branch Thin. I'll give me Falco. Hey, I can be hey. called Branch Thin. I don't give a shit. I got thick skin. No, I don't. <laughs> Alright, y'all have had enough time. Let's fight. I'm uh, slightly less thin than I used to be. Yeah, lost some weight, went on a diet. All pasta, all carbs. I don't know how it worked, but it did. Welcome to TKO. I'll let the tournament master explain some shit because, again, this game is a little complicated. I've summoned you all to T-shirt Island because you show incredible talent for T-shirt warfare. Except for one of you who I invited by mistake. But every tournament needs a loser, right? Chapter one. Your winding path to victory starts here at the training ground. You will use your device to draw two drawings. What you draw matters not. Let your heart be your guide. And All if right. your heart can't think of anything, just hit the suggestion button. It's time for your first drawing right now. All right, so draw something, y'all. If you get a few color options, I don't think you get... I think there's an undo button, but no eraser. Welcome to the silent part, the drawings part of the stream. <laughs> Everybody's thinking real hard. Alright, so this is just your first drawing. Once we're all done, I think we're going to do another one. <laughs> Monkey in a hot spring with a phone. Bad idea there. Let him check his feed. Don't be... Don't be a boomer. <laughs> Now, if he had it in a Ziploc baggie... Yeah, you know you know how to shower with your phone. Yeah. Alright. Not bad, but let's be a little variety this time. 
you can change your life. This is very hard to draw with my finger. On to yeah, on a two. phone. That's probably that, that's kind of the point. Good, there is a backup button. There. It's perfect! It's beautiful! What a work of art. What about the wonder lock? I said what a work of art. Play Store is at a website. It's uh, jackbox.tv. Check the uh, top corner there. Uh, go to that website, enter that code, and you can join the audience. The game audio is really quiet. Uh, yeah. Let me turn it up. I'll turn up the game and Thorn. I, don't, I would need to pause the game in order to turn up the game itself. So Thorn's going to be a little louder, too. Or phrases as you I can, can turn myself down. Something short and snappy, like you might see on a t shirt. And don't let hubris consume you. Use a suggestion if you need one. Alright, so just type as much shit as possible. Keep hitting the suggestion button instead of the check mark. I'm a furry, what are you doing? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Make haste before time runs out. Oh. Oh yes. Yeah. This is gonna be good. Is he just spamming? Enough. Yeah. Spamming. Direct your attention to your device. Select one drawing and <laughs> one slogan to create the perfect right, one sh t-shirt combination. And I do mean perfect. All right, you only get a few to choose from. So if you got all of I'm a furry's like one letter responses, then I'm sorry. I only get two drawings to choose from? Shit. get like two drawings to choose from and then like three word thingies to pick. Yeah. I guess this is the best combo. The slogan will get me to victory. Perfect. The battlefield calls. Well, I hope that Let the one of mine makes it in the barrage of whatever the hell one. I'm a furry did. <laughs> I'm sure it will. <laughs> There might be a ghost! <laughs> there might be a ghost. That's a double reference right there. That's like, gets you double stream points. Get Gibero, and you get Mike. There might be a ghost. There might be a ghost. Does Gibero. Well, I guess he has to believe in ghosts. 
he found one. <laughs> he saw one. Yeah. Kulalu doesn't believe in ghosts, though. The ghost destroyed my laptop. Ah, the reference. But I still like it either way. It was you! You had the reference. I didn't even realize it was a reference. I just thought it was funny. <laughs> there might be a ghost. Is that cat the Santa of Ballsmas? <laughs> Just the Santa of Balls. <laughs> I see you've been a good boy this year. Have, Have another testicle. <laughs> I see the ring jing jingling dang dang dangling. Ah, <laughs> oh, your shirt got destroyed. Come on, it's lovely weather to slap him and cover him in hair. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> <laughs> These are like connected. These are both ball shirts. For the uh, for the holiday of balls. The ball day, if you will. Oh, fuck. Which one do I like more? I kind of like this one. <laughs> That's the Santa from Silver's time, because Santa stopped showing up. <laughs> Remember that one episode of Billy and Mandy, where Santa was a vampire? And then he stopped showing up? <laughs> well, that episode was a documentary. Is <laughs> right-handed <laughs> I don't know you get you get plus points for the titty reference you get D points for the gnomed <laughs> get gnomed <laughs> he's not a ganelf it's true he's a titty Oh, that's that's a fake titty right there. I should draw like I should draw a titty. I draw titties, but I, I should draw like an actual like good drawing of like our character titty. Our good friend, our hero titty. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think the person who drew it knows what it is. It's is fuck. A duck? <laughs> it's fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck a duck, screw it. There is eyes and lips and a tongue. I guess it's a weird face. Whoa. You get to. For some reason, this game lets you vote for your own answer. And I'm like, why I'm wouldn't you do that? Here. If you're honest with yourself. God has abandoned us, but I'm making him pay child support. <laughs> Jackpot champ. <laughs> I would wear this shirt. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, for, for those curious, all of these shirts you can purchase after this game. So if you like any one of them, you can buy them. I wouldn't wear never use a condom, but I would wear... <laughs> I never use a condom, because I never get a chance. <laughs> and I'm engaged. That's the real fucking weird thing. You gotta be good. I want you to fight. No. <laughs> The weird thing about the Tatsumaki Shimpiaku, whenever they say it in Street Fighter, I can never actually hear it. 
I mean, I hear it. But I'm like, that's what they're fucking saying? I really... I was really into Street Fighter for like a couple weeks a few months ago. <laughs> Full audience. <laughs> Aw, you bunny. Streak winner. Bunny had a rough life. Gauntlet winner. This feels like a good time for a training break. Chapter three. All right, now we kind of just do the same thing again. to enter one new drawing and as many new slogans as you wish. Don't let me down. Go. My line is to draw. There we go. Oops, shit. Third verse, same as the first. This is the saddest thing I've ever drawn. Very glad I played this instead of Celeste. <laughs> I mean, I, I fucking love Celeste, don't get me wrong, but... I'm just surprised we haven't done this earlier. We've been meaning to do a Jackbox stream for ages. This is an old school Jiggly Jacob stream. Oh yeah. Furry. Furry it up. Oh. <laughs> I just realized that was a pun. I didn't even mean for it to be. I can't believe you've done it. And there he goes again. That was, that was really short. The second gauntlet is at hand, and the ethereal oh, good. shark has redistributed your drawing. <laughs> you know what to do. Make a shirt. <laughs> Make a shirt. <laughs> like two of the three is the garbage. Oh. Yeah, I'm afraid. Try not to do that again. It kind of just dilutes the. Uh... The fun. That loots the uh, field, if you will. What is that? Right, I guess I'll go with this. <laughs> oh, you were waiting for me. I'm sorry, y'all. Jesus Christ! Uh, uh, I like both of these. I like the furry. I think it's a furry because that looks like a tail. Or is that the hand? <laughs> I think that's a hand. I am electing to believe that is a bunny tail. Okay, you can believe what you would like. This is interpretive art. Kill the whites and qu quit spamming. <laughs> you absolute, absolute baboon. baboon. <laughs> Yay. Oh, a new 
Why didn't nice. buy a fucking baboon? Ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> I would okay. I've been skate. I've been learning how to skateboard lately. I would wear that and stand in the corner of the skate park on my skateboard and stare at people wearing this. <laughs> that would also be a really good face to put on a skateboard. Oh yeah. Oh fuck this. I'll I'll make this T-shirt into my uh, skate deck. All right. To be fair, I think I only voted for the one on the left because I had to. I drew it. <laughs> A new challenger appears. <laughs> <laughs> I imagine that eye is just him getting really close to the camera. It's like, let me tell you. Let me tell you. <laughs> I had a car, like the whole car. <laughs> I hit a car. What? The whole car? I, I ate a car. Oh, the ate a car. car. <laughs> I actually really want the You Cannot Escape My Wrath shirt, for real. I mean, we could buy one, apparently. Whoever drew this lovely piece will not get any uh, credit for it, but welcome to the internet. Don't be so sure. Wow. I, 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 I thought Let Me Tell You was going to take it. Let me actually, I made the Let Me Tell You shirt. Well, I didn't make the art or the bottom, but I put it yeah, together. Yeah, I, I made the bottom. Dear God, help. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's what bob -Oms think at all times while being alive. <laughs> Dear God, help. Dear God, help. Dude, fucking God, yo. I'm gonna shit myself. You get You get Well, everything I'm voting for is not it's not winning. Either way I feel really good because I, I drew the uh scary face. Fight each other. What? <laughs> what do you mean what? <laughs> this is the one you say what to? <laughs> It's a pentagram, you know these. <laughs> oh, I thought it was like a D20. Kind of looks like a D20. I mean... What's all this shit in the middle? Shit you summon demons with. That's fucking silly string Marbles. and confetti. <laughs> yeah, I didn't like this one either. It's uh, all I could go with, though. <laughs> Y'all need to back up from the camera, okay? <laughs> Let me tell you. These are love very me. dark. Let me tell you to love me. That's a donut, right? Sure. S s s you. Sir s s s s I don't know how to pronounce your name. Oh god. Church. A new challenger appeared. Oh, and I drew that eyeball. <laughs> really badly. <laughs> it was supposed to be an eyeball, not a donut. <laughs> the snail with a sword. Did you draw that by chance? Yes, you did. Okay, that answers my question. Without you answering my question. No, that's not one of furries. That's an actual uh, acronym. Hug girlfriends. And girlfriends love snails with swords. Yeah. Dear God help is running the gauntlet. <laughs> Martin, don't you do it. Winner. Don't scream for help. 
of chapter five, the king is sure. So now, like the winners uh, from the uh, last two rounds, get to battle it out. Dear God, help! Versus. <laughs> the championship belt just brings it all together. <laughs> That's what you say when you've won the match. Yeah. You are champion. Like, this is what I bought with this child support. Pretty sure these two have already gone head to head. That's how we got yeah. the Jackbox Champ shirt to go as far as it did. Nearly unanimous. Question Deco wins. Boy, that was fun, CJ's guys. slogan. Of, yeah, of course, it was your slogan. <laughs> All right, that one won the tournament. Now it's, there's a few other stats that are interesting. Your slogans were used on four shirts. I know CJ. it made me feel really good. Question Deco's art was used in three shirts. Question Decca just kind of destroyed all of us, I guess. Finished a drawing in 24 seconds. <laughs> the least used drawings and slogans, Thorn. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, really? 562 total drawings and slogans. Is that so? But actually, don't do that again. I'd appreciate it. All right. Um, I feel like TKO is the game you can only play like once. It's a long one. Yeah. So let's see what else we got here. I this is Jackbox three. I have one, three, and four. Faking it. God, I love faking it. But you have to actually be in the room in order to play it. What was Gaspianage again? Uh, I don't remember. Uh, Trivia Murder Party? That's a classic. Trivia Murder Party that much because I'm so bad at trivia. Fair enough. Fibbage is a good time. It is. Uh, Civic Doodle, Surviving the Internet. Fuck, which one had Fibbage 2? Is that Party Pack 4? I think it was. I know I have it. Yes, it is Party Pack 4. Okay. Alright, yeah. Let's go with Fibbage. It's a trivia game, technically, but it's funny enough. Fibbed edge. My toe is fucking killing me. I think I have something wrong with my foot. I should go to the doctor. I need to lower the game. Hold on. Uh, full screen mode for the extended timers, required twitch, manual censoring. Uh, okay, I can trust you guys. This is very Katamari music. Alright, so. 
so here's our code. Hold on, let me join first. I'm an eyeball. Now it's your turn, CJ. Oh, yeah. And let me get the code to Thorn. If you can guess it, and you, you can get in early, it's almost the last name of somebody named Vince. It McMahon? No. Well, I guess it would have been Vince Cross. Is anybody called Vince McMahon Vince? Oh, yes, absolutely. Or Vinny? Yes, very much. Who the fuck calls Vincent McMahon Vinny? Somebody, probably. All right, guys. Uh, this, oh, I don't want it to be, but this will probably be the last game of the night. I just need to go to sleep. I have work in the morning. Fuck. Uh, hold on. Here we go. Bam! Join the game! Thorn's dick. I thought I could trust you guys. The. The. Wait. Hold on. Do I have the audience on? Is my dick one of the little radish dudes from Final Fantasy? <laughs> I thought there was a plant coming out of an eyeball. Uh, I don't... Is the... Uh, the audience isn't on. Here, I want y'all to be able to participate. I'm really sorry to the people who fucking joined. Um, be quick when I, uh, when I bring up the next game, because I do want audience participation on. Sorry. There. Let me just make sure everything else I want is on. Alright. The audience is on this time. On fire! That is a, a very poor rapper name. I feel like that was Kevin Federline's uh, first name before he first gave attempt. up. <laughs> Alright. Again, sorry. Those who joined earlier, be quick. But I can't guarantee you'll get back in. I'm really sorry. Bam. K-Fry. Okay, so apparently the guy who did that animation with the intro to episode 9 with his characters, Yellow and Guru. Yeah. He's 17, so when that episode came out, he was 7. Oh, God! I bet you guys feel old. I mean, you guys. I guess I knew what SFA was 10 years ago and you didn't. I guess. Yeah. God damn. For those unaware, and we posted this in the Discord, somebody made a really fucking good animation um, out of a line uh, or a scene from Sergeant Farrago Bridge Episode 9. Ah, uh, it's so good. Um, if you want, you could link it in the chat. That may be a good idea. Oh, you already did. Well, let's play. <laughs> I did it while you were talking. Ah. Oof, that logo hurt my eyes and my throat. Welcome to my parlor. I'm Cookie Masterson, but here you can call me Mr. Applewhite. Ugh. Eight player game? Is it my birthday or something? Well, it is, but this isn't about me. Oh, and if anybody else wants to join, they can get in the audience at any time. You can vote on decoy answers to trip up the players, and you get to take a shot at guessing the truth. Let's go. All right, so listen to Cookie as he explains the rules, because I forgot to do so before we started. <laughs> this is round one, which means... All right, Alex you get World, thanks for watching. Points ...for everyone you fool with your made-up answer. And you'll get a cool thousand for finding the truth. My dick, what? <laughs> I didn't even notice that. First up, 
Responding to a myth about the supposed health benefits, Dr. Jen Gunter issued a May 2017 warning urging women not to put blank in their vaginas. Now, enter a bluff on vaginas. your device that sounds real enough to fool the other players. If you're stuck, for half the points, you can hit the lie for me button and get a suggestion. Do it. All right, so basically you enter an answer that you think will fool people into thinking it's the right answer, and you get points if people pick your answer. Everybody answered. I don't know why it's oh, okay. Okay, these are your choices. <laughs> pick the truth on your device now. Okay, now you pick the answer you think is correct. Red lobster cheddar biscuits. <laughs> And you can also give, like, kudos. Oh, shit, I selected that one. I thought it was, like, choose your favorite. <laughs> no. Like, choose which one you think is right. <laughs> I like how one says men, like, that was, pick. like, I understand the intention there, but I'm just thinking of, like, an entire unbirthing process. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, only the audience picked cucumbers. No, those are totally safe to put there. Just wash them first. Yeah. Essential oils. These are actually a lot of really good answers. Like, I, I would have believed a lot of these. <laughs> but you guys believed the wrong one. <laughs> Jacob comes through with the corn. Sket Kiriel. Cyril. Cyril. A lot of diversity in these answers. It's no use. Ah, oh, the audience lie. I can't believe it. Boom. I can't believe I got it right. Oh, so did I. High five. <laughs> yeah, oh, we wow. know Shit. what not to put in pussies. What? Okay, we can't high five either. <laughs> Don't buzz your pussy. Don't buzz your puss. If I remember correctly, that was actually a, like, I remember that happening. Uh, all right, my turn to pick a thing. Important in quotes, research. Sounds like porn, so I'll select it. And the question is, in an odd 1929 experiment, two Princeton researchers were successfully able to transform a cat into... I may be wrong, but this is not porn. Your lies now. Uh... Sometimes you just gotta pick one that's funny. God damn it, I shouldn't have done that. No one's gonna pick it. <laughs> I couldn't think of anything. Did you pick the lie for me? No. I just wrote something stupid instead. Hurry up, use a suggestion. Okay, look for the truth and pick it. A cat that wasn't an asshole. Impossible. <laughs> Into a micro lion. <laughs> Transformed a cat into dog. I like another cat. <laughs> into hamster. How? What's the right answer? What? <laughs> I don't know why I'm picking this one, but I am. Let's see what you so guys there's did. always there's usually one that stands out, but this one's like, what the fuck is the answer? All of the asshole cats live with us, I guess. Was it? Oh no! The audience lie. Uh, 
you vote for that? I thought it was fine. I, I don't know why. I, I don't know what's the correct answer. But it's not that one. Heh <laughs> heh. Damn it, I knew it was something like that. A telephone. The first call was from PETA. The first call was from PETA, he says. <laughs> How? Sometimes with an answer that's so weird, like Cookie will explain why that's the answer. But not this time. Alright, your turn to pick a category. Um... Niche videos. Oh no, you're gonna know the answer. Ow! Oh god, my foot! Product unboxing videos are weird, then you clearly haven't I don't out think Victoria product unboxing. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Write your lies now. You know this answer, don't you? I feel like I know this answer. I feel like this sounds like I don't know what the answer is, but it sounds like something that'd be covered by Huang. That that I got with the long hair and the curly mustache. Not, I feel like I know exactly who this guy is. Not, not our friend Hai Wang. I don't know. <laughs> oh my god, I think I know the answer. Well, you're running out of time to answer. Oh, you already did. You're not... You're not Googling it, are you? No, 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 no. I had to okay. figure out how to spell something. All right. Hey, pick the truth. Oof. Ooh. Okay, actually, okay. I like that answer. It's clever enough that even if it's wrong, I'm okay with selecting it. Uploading other people's videos. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't think I know. Yeah, unboxing videos are not that weird. Maybe they were... I don't know, when did this Jackbox come out? I not that long part. ago. You see, this was a great fucking answer. And I would watch a channel that did repackaging videos. So I'm okay with getting that wrong. Does I accept anybody it. know what that is? Or does anybody know what I'm talking about? Homunculus sperm egg videos? Yes, does anybody know? No! <laughs> There's a channel on YouTube where a guy injects unfertilized chicken eggs with his sperm. And he makes a homunculus. That's great. <laughs> That's really great to hear, CJ. Please look up the homunculus videos. I'm not gonna. Everybody needs to take a look into those fucking homunculus videos. Zit pop. Yeah. Plenty of people make How zit popping videos. Now, excuse me, there's a new Russian grandma escalator fails video I need to watch. What is Vikram Yadav so? What makes him so special? You got five points, Thorn. That's how Google said homunculus was Get spelled. For round two, where all the points are doubled. Double the points. Okay, pick a category. Airport security, alright. Okay, here's your question. Authorities at JFK Airport made an impressive bust in April 2017 when they seized over 300 pounds of illegally smuggled blank. I feel like I also know the answer okay, to this. To your lives. Mm. 300 pounds of illegally smuggled... Sure. About half the time left, CJ. <sighs> Write something quick or use the lie for me button. Okay, which one's the truth? Yak meat. 
amiibos. 300 pounds of illegally smuggled man. <laughs> <laughs> um, cocaine's too easy. You guys are really fucking good at this. Like, there's a lot of answers where I'm like, is that it? I wonder if I own 300 pounds of Amiibo. <laughs> I, okay, do I don't think I do. Pick. Audience, come on. You're really gonna give Shaykun these points for Amiibos. Good answer, CJ. I would have picked that if I didn't pick another thing. Ooh. Good points for Tonky Donk. Somebody actually thought my answer was it. It, it was cocaine. Cocaine is an impressive bust. Body parts. What if only 6% of the audience got the right answer and no one else? Yeah! Yak meat! Thank goodness for those yak-sniffing dogs. I knew I shouldn't have picked cocaine. This is just like that one episode of Yakety Yak. <laughs> <laughs> That's one to show I'm surprised we didn't use during the LP. Who the... Okay, chat, who remembers Yakety so Yak? Much. I literally only remember that it existed. How about this? Anybody remember Corneal and Bernie? No. Of course, the title of this Not at all. Is, they are blank. All right, <laughs> this is, oddly enough, a screenshot from Yakety Yak. A lot of the audience remembers the uh, show Yakety Yak. That's good. Oh my god, that rings a bell. I think I All saw right, an episode. The truth? Years <laughs> they, ago. they are no use! <laughs> this one. He's just like that episode selected. of Yakety Yak when he fell in a chipper. Ugh. <laughs> Holy shit, guys. <laughs> what a word. Yeah, twined, I don't think that's an actual word, but I used it anyway. It seems like it would have been a word at the time this was made. Sorry. I thought I picked that one. What did I pick? Oh yeah, I picked this one. Damn it! <laughs> uh. What is it? What the fuck it? is the answer? Existing? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, oh well, 14% of the audience, great That's job. Blue bowl got his start. Sorry, no use. <laughs> you know, when a, when a really complex painting is just called self-portrait. <laughs> Holy shit. Thanks for picking Twined, guys. I just took the lead. I'm gonna fucking punt you. <laughs> Fast food. Alright. Sinatra crime? Here's the question. <laughs> As part of a 1998 publicity Sinatra crime. Burger King announced that their Whoppers would now be blank. Whopper. Realize now. Uh. Martin, what are you meowing about? I can't jump over the fence anymore. Stupid. <laughs> Use a 
suggestion if you can't think of anything. That eye just does just look like a Mandragora. The one on the far right. <laughs> okay, which one is the truth? Available by oh, mail. One. Wow, if, if the first one is the answer, then man, Uber Eats before Uber Eats was a thing. <laughs> I didn't even read that one. All right, who picked what? Thanks, Danny. No, that wouldn't be until twenty nineteen. Oh, my dick. Bam! That was a lot of points. If I get beat by my dick. Well, I had it coming. Wait. There was like seven different double entendres there. Fucking every time with the audience lie. It's supposed to be convincing. I know. But it, I specifically keep picking it. Oh, God. A whopper made of whoppers? Oof. I don't even like Whoppers, like the burger, but I do like the candy. Left handed. What the fuck is wrong with you, what? Burger King? I know this was like 20 years before people said this, but Silence Brand. Fucking okay, left handed burger. All right, the final Fabage. Pay attention, cause this last one's worth triple points. Have fun. Gotta make this one count. South Dakota had to cancel a public oh, safety campaign due to people <laughs> reading it as a sexual euphemism. The message was, don't blank and blank. Type in your lies now. <laughs> um. <laughs> I'm not even trying anymore. <laughs> um. Not trying either, but man, I'm happy I just <laughs> typed what I typed. Hurry, hit the live for me button if you can't think of something. Okay, here are your choices. Yeah, the black Halloween Whopper. That, that was the one I was thinking of. Oh yeah, that That's one. That's what I thought it was. I never ate it. Load and explode. <laughs> what happens in South Dakota? Um. <laughs> Don't eat roosters and eat cats. Oh no! I didn't mean to pick that. <laughs> Damn it! Oh, I didn't mean to. Fuck! I didn't mean to click that. Damn it! Oh shit! No, I wanted ah. Uh... I didn't read one that I think is the right answer. <laughs> Full disclosure, since I mean I don't think anybody's gonna pick it if they're smart. Uh, mine was don't wank hey, and wakeboard. <laughs> I, <don't think> so. <laughs> I don't think there is anywhere to wakeboard in South Dakota, considering it's you know landlocked. So upset. Oh my God, the audience lie. I didn't even mean to put God. That. That one took a lot of people, too. If this was Fibbage 1, fucking, you'd lose points for picking that. <laughs> Runk and stunk. <laughs> Runk and stunk. <laughs> Don't run and stunk. 
Who's the asshole in the audience who keeps picking my bad ones? He's <laughs> <laughs> giving you points. Is that you? I'm a furry. Wait. Oh, okay. Eat roosters and eat cats. I'm so mad. Jerk and drive. Yeah, I saw that one after I already picked, and I was like, yeah, that's that's the answer. Who wins? I think it might be me. It's not me! It's no use! <laughs> <laughs> it is no use, Jacob. I know it's not. Who got the thumbs up the butt cup? My dick. Great. <laughs> <laughs> got a thumb up your dick. Oh, oh. Mm, mm. <laughs> Never say What's that, that sound? sound? Stop. <laughs> Oh. You only got root beer on my nose. Oh, I'm so sorry, Thorn. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. I really want to continue, but I need to sleep. I don't. I'm tired enough. I can sleep, but I don't want to. So I gotta get going. I gotta. I got work in the morning. CJ and I both do. I'm not gonna skateboard tomorrow though. My legs hurt. <laughs> And uh, there's probably going to be a lot of scooter children at the skate park that I don't want to get in the way of. Because they'll beat me up. Do you don't want to be around. Razor scooters. <laughs> it's, not, it's not so much being around them. It's the fact they know what they're doing at a skate park and I don't. So I don't want to get in their way. And you look like you could be a pro skateboarder, so like, it's extra embarrassing. <laughs> I'm a little... You know, I'm not... I wouldn't say I'm fat, but I'm a little chunky. Like, most pro skaters are very thin boys. Maybe me five years ago could look like a pro skater, but... I think the neutral version of fiancé is fiancé. Yeah. Fiancé is very gender neutral. Is there even gendered terms for fiancé, or is it just fiancé? Pretty sure it's just fiancé. Like, like, all genders call their other a fiance gender nooch <laughs> it sounds like a sounds like a type of worm Ugh. like a parasitic worm or a or an onomatopoeia it's fiance what are you doing when you gender nooch <laughs> uh scooting along the ground Whilst, when you got worms. <laughs> whilst proclaiming my gender. <laughs> no, scooting along the ground in a way that suits my gender. So like I'm 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 a male, so I would have to scoot masculinely somehow. <laughs> I'm a man and I itch. <laughs> I do. I do itch. Jacob has influenced my vocab an uncomfortable amount. Good. <laughs> Eating one's anatomy out the window. <laughs> All right, I really, again, I, I don't want to stop, but I, I got to get to sleep, y'all. This was so much fun. Um, I don't know when I'll do it again. Thorne, we should probably, now that everything's all set up, we should probably record some Sekiro parts on Sunday, yeah? Yeah, we need to record soon. Yes. Um, I will be leaving for a football game at like 5 my time, so let's record in like the early afternoon if you can. Already. Yeah. All right, cool. Straw Hat No Plans made live. Um, but yeah, thanks for coming, guys. A ton of fun. We, do, we need to do this like regularly, in my opinion. I should get the other Jackbox games I don't have. I don't have 2, I don't have 5. I think there's a six. If there is a six, I don't have it. Um, but yeah. Good night, guys. See you around. Uh, look forward to uploads returning probably next week. Bye. I hope so. Bye, everyone. <laughs>